All right, guys, I received my bus bars from my 160 amp hour Yinglong bank from Ill Customs today. So I want to go ahead and do an unboxing video and kind of show you what I received from them. Then after they're done balancing, I'm going to go ahead and do a assembly video as well. But for now, I'm just going to do an unboxing. Comes with Hill Customs sticker for a vehicle. Very well packed. Each, each thing is packed individually. Oh, a second Hill Customs sticker. Here I believe we have the bolts. So I've got enough bolts to assemble the whole bank. Just verify that they fit. Yep, fit perfectly. So we got look like they're a serrated flange bolt. One bus bar. Two. Three. Four. Need five of these and then the two end pieces. One and two. So as you see here we got five end pieces. They look to be half inch thick, recessed in. Um, Ill Customs etched logo also has these screws for a balance bar. So five identical lows. Then we have the end, which has two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, four, sixteen one out inputs, screws for a balancer, recessed bolt holes, and then these are uh, set screw holes for the one out. It's probably three inches thick by four inches wide. So nice solid piece, all 6061 aluminum. So much like what you would see with their other products as well as Jim's Metalworks, Toolmaker. Um, they all use the same type of aluminum. So let's see if I have the set screws are probably in here with the bolts. And they aren't, so I must have got it in the box. So, looks like it is missing the set screws, so I will contact them about that. But other than that, everything else appears to be there. And thanks guys again. If you like the videos, go ahead and subscribe below. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Thank you.